South African born, now Scotland international, Jakob van der Waalt gets things underway and instantly take themselves towards the 22, but the kick will just be from, oh sorry, rather the line out will be from just outside. There's a Stormers side who have been strong defensively, third best in the overall defensive stats from the opening two rounds. Here's Cammy Hutchinson, though. Good. Now Mata, Van der Waalt on a show and go, and he's got a man on his shoulder, and there's only one man that Edinburgh fans wanted to see running onto that loose ball. It's the electric Darcy Graham. What a start he's having to this season. The starting berth for the man signed from Harlequins over the summer. Bellicott. Van der Waal, he's seen another gap, he's through it again. And now he's got Bellicott on his shoulder. It's another one from nowhere. For another player of the match performance already. And Jakub Van der Waal just spotting Namakawa. Not pushing up in the line, Offside slightly the drifting. No, it's fine. Yeah, they were good timing. Quite close. Yeah, yeah. Was good timing. And all South African supporters would be wanting Jakub van der Waal to come back to South Africa and show those skills in a South African team. Arguably, before we might have seen a kick off first phase. Straight forward, extra two points, and just like that. Ben Bellicott with the clearances, fielded by Boric Halland. Good running coming from Ivan Roos, the big no, number eight. Actually not trying to 28 carries in the opening two rounds. That one has gone no, astray, one. but no, legally no. as Peterson managed to get his hands on it. And it goes out from Hintabeni. The backs can have a go here, danger. Out wide, it's De Jong, the Centurion. Good contest. Now there for De Vett, the scrum half. Again, it's gone loose, but it's picked up by the Stormers. And into Benny, has got a man in his shoulder. And it is Halant, and Vonick Halant, who scored at Thoman Park last week. And the man who's got a World Cup winner's medal. One time cap Springbok. Finds his man well in Salman Murat. Three, not on the left. Here's the skipper. Play on, that advantage. Two young players in the second row, but they're the co captains for this Listen European to tour you alongside Erens van Rijn. Safety to the To look for three points for the Stormers. That one sails through the middle and after. Here is Lucas Pretorius' his advantage coming for the high tackle into Benny. He's been everywhere in this first half. De Vett. Van Rijn. De Vett with the short one. Ruiz has got De Vett on his shoulder. And coming in is Paul De Vett. For a couple of phases, not spelling it, that man Evan Ruiz. Halant in open space, just route one to direct. Voldovet in for Stefan Ungerer. Oh, penalty. And he squeezes that one in. Parity did not last long. Edinburgh regained the lead. Set. Out it comes and De Vett's got a battle on for it. Offside. Roos has managed to help him out. There's advantage coming for the Stormers. There's a long pass and it's into the arms of Majano. At the Damhill Stadium. Tim Sweel has a swing with his right boot. Through it goes. Thank Stormers you. getting their first real opportunity in Edinburgh's half. Nobody going anywhere. This one is going to be a tight conclusion. Tunison doing well, but just managed to go as low as he possibly could to halt him.
Velikot. And VP Nell with the juggling act. It goes Very forward. Van der Valt now says enough is enough. And it will be the draw with 84 minutes on the clock. Well, it was the finish really that the game deserved. Both sides absolutely going for it.